Well, Coach Whitten was this grandfatherly type figure on the one hand, on the other hand, he was God. He came from a background that basically respected people for who they were and what they could do, not what was the color of their skin. It was beyond speeches and words and talk, but in his actions. When he put on the boxing gloves, uh, there was a tiger in there. It wasn't a game, it was an event. It was a moment in history. Those steely blue eyes would look at you, that brow would furrow up. Goodness gracious sakes alive, you will never play another minute here at UCLA. All that showboat, that fancy showboat, I don't want to see none of it. I've seen enough of it. It was art. I mean, it was Picasso, Rembrandt. I mean, it was John Wood and Coach Wood. What's your opinion of college basketball today and the status of college <clears throat> basketball? I think the players today are better than ever. I don't think the teams are. I think that <clears throat> Toby. Kobe, Kobe, Kobe Bryant. Yeah. I think he may be the best individual player the, the game has had. They could do more things, offense, defense, rebound, shoot, but I wouldn't pick him to start a team. Of the current players, who would you pick to start a team? You wouldn't pick Kobe, but who, any, any, any <clears throat> LeBron, Kevin Gardner, I mean, any, any of the guy, current guys that you really like? LeBron, I really like. LeBron? Yeah, yeah. Was, LeBron, he's a little, a little stronger. It's all better today, yeah. it's better today. Even better than you, Marcus. Uh oh, <laughs> I don't know about that. No, no, no. I'm just kidding. I know that you communicate with a lot of coaches. Uh, uh, John Calipari, the coach of Kentucky. You guys have talked recently. But he thinks too much is being expected of him. What should he do about it? <laughs> he he came to the right person. Yeah, I said lose a few. <laughs> <laughs> lose a few games. And, yeah. And then, then yeah, yeah. They're, 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 they're going to expect they, you know, they get, they get on you a little bit. But, yeah. Yeah. Our coach today, I think he's a very good coach, outstanding uh, defensive coach, but I'd like to see him move more. Yeah. And uh, that's just what I'd like to see. I mean, that's right. So you'd like to see Coach Allen's teams would play a little bit more fast break kind of yeah, basketball, yeah, kind yeah. of get up and down the court like, like your teams did? Yeah, more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think Coach Wynn's legacy really has to do with his ability to, to use sports as a metaphor for life, to teach great life skills through the means of basketball. So many of his sayings he said on the basketball floor come back to you in so many different situations, work, business, career, family, kids. And you go through some obstacles, you go through some adversity, that's when the influence of Coach Wooden uh, has its most compelling impact on your life? Well, if uh, I, as a coach, have been able to contribute to anything, that's it. All you have to do is try your best. And don't worry what the outcome is going to be. Try your best. And if you can get that across, you've done an awful lot.